I want to discuss what has been referred to as the Deering Meadows Agreement, your unilateral capitulation to the pro-Hamas, anti-Israel, anti-Semitic encampment. But let's talk about what has occurred on this encampment. Isn't it true that Jewish Northwest, a Jewish Northwestern student was assaulted? So I want to question the premise of your question. No, 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 no. I'm asking the questions. You're answering. Wasn't my it answer true? Is, no, no, no. It's I'm, not a capitulation. I'm, I'm asking the question. You're required to answer. Isn't it true that a Jewish Northwestern student was assaulted? There are allegations that a Jewish student was assaulted. We are investigating those allegations. How long are these investigations going to occur? Well, if you remember, the encampment was up just a few weeks ago. Why didn't you include Israeli faculty members when you put out the Deering Meadows Agreement? Because the Deering Meadows Agreement was just a framework of an agreement that was reached with students at 4 o'clock in the morning. At the pro-Hamas encampment. The, if you would like to see the entire program, go on our website and that will explain it to you, and you will see. No, I'm it asking you about what Title the university VI. put out. There is no mention of Israeli students or Israeli faculty. Isn't that the case? In the the agreement that we reached, that there wasn't Israeli students there or Jewish because students because they weren't there. consulted. Isn't that the fact?